So this next list is my six UK holdings in the capital goods sector. So they're all from different industries. I think there's a few aerospace and defences, pretty common one, construction services. Yeah, just the two, construction services and aerospace and defence. So number one is BAE Systems. Ticker symbol is BA. It looks like BA full stop. Hmm. Trading for about five pounds fifty six pence per share. It's in the aerospace and defence industry, and it's a security company as well, with five segments. Dividend yield of four point two six percent. Pays its dividends twice a year, and the last two I received, the interim was nine pence, and the final was fourteen point five pence per share. Second is Balfour Beatty. Ticker symbol is BBY. Trading for about two pounds ninety four pence per share. It's in the construction services industry. And it's an infrastructure company that provides maintenance, upgrades, and management services in power transmission, utilities infrastructure, and road and rail. Dividend yield is 1.55%, currently has zero earnings per share, which is not good. So it pays a dividend twice a year, but I have not received one yet. Next is Bellway, ticker symbol is BWY, trading for about £34.95 pence per share. It's also in the construction services industry and it's a holding company of the Bellway group of companies. It has a dividend yield of 2.46%, pays a dividend once a year annually but I have not received one yet. Next is Persimmon, ticker symbol is PSN, trading for about £28.28 £28 per share. It's also in the construction services industry and it's engaged in house building within the United Kingdom. i actually make sure that's in my other house building video that's to come. No, it's not. I better add that in. House building. So persimmon, ticker symbol is PSN, trading for twenty eight pounds twenty eight pence. Construction services industry, dividend yield of three point eight three percent. Pays a dividend semi annually. And the last one I received was for one pound and ten pence per share. Next is Rolls Royce Holdings. Ticker symbol is RR. Trading for about one pound ten pence per share. Fell off a cliff in 2020. That's lockdown. Ooh. Big discounts. So it's a UK based engineering company, it's in the aerospace and defence industry and it's focused on power and propulsion systems. There's no dividend yield given but it pays a dividend twice a year, probably not for a while given the current stock price, maybe a small one. And the last one is Q in Q Group. Ticker symbol is QQ, trading for £3.37 pence per share. And it's in the aerospace and defence industry. It's a science and engineering company operating in the defence, security and aerospace markets. Dividend yield is 2%. 
and it pays a semi-annual dividend. The last one I received was for 4.7 pence per share. So that's it for the UK dividend stocks in the capital goods sector. It's another nice and short one. Yeah, this other one, Houck's Building. There's still quite a few positions here, quite a few stocks that I don't have any position in at all. So I have to, the next time I have a bit of money to invest, I'm going to use it to add, even put one or two euro into any of these companies that I don't have a position in, and then I can do videos on these. So if there's one for renewables, one for the tobacco industry, one for house building, and one for casinos and gaming. But I'll get them done as soon as I have a little bit of savings to invest. I think maybe I'll only need like 30 euro to fill them all up. And also, if you have any UK capital goods, dividend stocks that you hold or that you'd recommend, please let me know, because I've only got a few. Well, I hope this was useful, and I hope that you stop by again soon.